Uh, we talked about a lot of the same issues on water because those obviously concern uh, our communities and also the livelihood of the community, uh, the economy. So there was a lot of a variety of issues and some things uh, we're looking forward to on some communication uh, issues that we're dealing with in Congress. Yeah, I shared with them that uh, as we're trying to find some common ground to get the votes to uh, secure the border and open up the government, one of the conversations I've had with other senators and the White House is related to funding for infrastructure at the ports of entry. Part of the proposal we'll vote on tomorrow includes uh, non-intrusive detection equipment at every port, which is really important for the contraband and the hard drugs coming through, deploying that across the whole country. But we also need to upgrade the infrastructure at the San Luis port, for one example, and there's a couple others in Arizona. So I still want to have this as part of the conversation. Uh, this should be something that Democrats and Republicans can agree is good for jobs, good for our economy, and good for security at the ports of entry, not just between the ports of entry. Last question. Anyone else? All right, guys are a good group. Uh, sorry, uh, I was here. Yeah. At the beginning. It's okay. Is it a time frame uh, when the shutdown will end? So I'm uh, flying to DC tonight on the red eye. Uh, we will have some votes tomorrow in the Senate. Uh, my hope is that uh, we can find some common ground where we can get at least seven Democrat senators to agree to some version or, uh, you know, amendments to the uh, version of uh, what the president proposed this weekend as a starting point anyway, as a step forward. Um, again, it's, it's providing resources for border security. It's providing more agents as well at the ports of entry and in between the ports of entry. It's doing something for the DACA population. Uh, it's addressing some of the concerns about the minors and asylum claims. Uh, this is a reasonable starting point, and our hope would be that we can find at least seven Democrat senators uh, who are for border security and for opening up the government, and we can work a negotiation that we can get out of the Senate. We then obviously got to get out of the House and sign by the President, so I cannot predict what's going to happen. I just can tell you we're doing some votes tomorrow, and we'll be having discussions on the way forward tomorrow, depending on how those votes go. Thank you, guys. Thanks, Thank everybody. You. Appreciate yeah, it. Right, right yes. Okay, we're doing a live shot. All right, everybody watch what you think. <laughs> <laughs>